brothers and sisters in Christ. Today's devotion is taken from The Desire of Ages by Ellen G. White, chapter 19, page 192. Jesus said to the disciples, I sent you to reap that where on ye bestowed no labor, other men labored, and ye are entered into their labors. The Savior was here looking forward to the great ingathering on the day of Pentecost. The disciples were not to regard this as the result of their own efforts. They were entering into other men's labors. Ever since the fall of Adam, Christ had been committing the seed of the word to his chosen servants to be sown in human hearts. And an unseen agency, even an omnipotent power, had worked silently but effectually to produce the harvest. The dew and rain and sunshine of God's grace had been given to refresh and nourish the seed of truth. Christ was about to water the seed with his own blood. His disciples were privileged to be laborers together with God. What does this reading tell you about Jesus? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for the privilege of laboring with you as a sower or reaper in your soul-winning work. In the name of Jesus, may you be greatly glorified. Amen. May you have a grand day ahead of you. Goodbye.